Hey Polish peeps, welcome to my channel. Welcome if you are new, hello. Um, so this is a swatch and review of October Polish Pickup. Um, the theme for this month is Sidekicks. And um, so I have, I think, seven polishes to review with you guys. Um, that way you guys can add them to your wish list if that is what you would like to do. If you are unfamiliar with how Polish Pickup works, I will list all of the details below in the description box for you guys. Also, you may want to check out my wish list video that can also give you some more information about Polish Pickup and polishes that you may want to add to your wish list. I'm doing this because there's a glare on my glasses <laughs> and it's driving me crazy. Um, Y'all will have to pardon my cat who is down below me singing to you guys. Hopefully that's not too disturbing. Um, but yeah, I will list all the information about Polish Pickup down below so you guys can check that out and if you're new hopefully that will give you enough information for you to make an informed decision that is very difficult at this time of the month every month um, so yeah that's uh, enough of an intro introduction let's just get to it okay so I'm going to use um, I've already posted all of these pictures on Instagram. If you're not following me on Instagram, you totally should be. Um, so you can also check out these pictures, but I'm going to insert uh, live swatch videos and um, pics of every polish that I talk about with you guys. Um, and since I have already posted it on Instagram, this is just the easiest way for me to um, pull the descriptions of the polishes for you guys. So first I have from All Mixed Up Lacquer. It is this gorgeous green flaky goddess right here. So pretty. So this is inspired by Cringe Battle Cat. Um, Adam He-Man's companion. And it is, I don't know what's wrong with my dog. She's being weird. Um, this is Ferociously Cringy. I think I'm saying that right. It's a thermal that is olive green in its cold state to clear. Um, when it's in its warm state, um, orange, red, gold, shifting shimmer, red, orange, gold, UCC flakies, and red, pink, orange, gold, lime, crystal chameleon flakes. That's a lot going on in this polish. It is gorgeous in both um, states, the cold state and the um, warm state. I really do love polishes that transition to like a clear because um, it just makes it extra fun. You can do like those peekaboo manis if you want where you um, do some stamping underneath and then you can only see the stamping when it's in its, in this case would be um, warm state because the warm state is clear. So yeah, those are always really fun. But y'all, check out these flakies. Like I love the flaky combination in here. So pretty. It's so like fall appropriate. Um, so just so you know, this will be priced at $12.50 and it has a cap of $200. So if you don't know exactly what um, it means when it has a cap, that means, for example, if they do a cap of 200, so when those 200 bottles are sold, then it'll be sold out and you can no longer get it. So um, you definitely want to hit those um, polishes that have a cap as soon as you can <laughs> so you don't miss out on that polish because it will, it has a higher possibility of selling out. So... Yeah, my cat is looking at me so weird right now. Okay, so that's all mixed up lacquers, and it is called, I'm going to mess up this name, but ferocious, Ferociously Cringy. Okay, next I have one from, this is Dainty Digits Lacquer, and it's this gorgeous silver beauty right here. Look how pretty. Um, so this one is, let me get to the description. Inspired by Bender Bending Rod Rod Rodriguez, Bite My Shiny Metal Polish is a fog, fog hat. I have never heard of that before. Fog hat gray, um, which is apparently Bender's official color with reflective pigment and linear hollow because we extra shiny. <laughs> this will be priced at $11 with a cap of $160. Y'all, this is so gorgeous. I... Um, can I, I don't even know if I can, I can't, I don't think I can turn on my, I was going to try to turn on my, uh, my flash so you guys could see the reflective glitter in this, but I am a huge fan of re reflective glitter. So, 
Um, I love this in both states and you can kind of see the reflective glitter from here which makes it just like so blingy and so just like shiny metal on your, on your nails. So it's really really pretty, has an amazing formula. So that is um, from Danny Digits Lacquer and it is called Bite My Shiny Metal. And it is priced at $11 with a cap of $160. Okay, so moving on, I have one from Trio Lacquer. And this is my first month swatching for Trio Lacquer. So super excited to be swatching for her um, for October Polish Pickup. This is her contribution. And again, reflective glitter, right? So pretty. Um, so this is called the doctor. No, no, no. It's not called the doctor. <laughs> That's the inspiration says the doctor. How long are you going to stay with me? Rose forever. Forever Rose is inspired by uh, my favorite doctor who companion Rose Tyler. Um, it is a burgundy jelly base filled with reflective silver glitter and iridescent glitter that flashes gold, orange, and red. I'm just not getting the inspiration for this polish. I'm so slow. It's Doctor Who. Like, what? <laughs> so slow. Um, Y'all, my cat is literally about to jump in my lap. This will be priced at $13 with a cap of $160. And it is such a gorgeous, like, berry shade. I love this color purple. I love the reflective glitter. I think it's really pretty. Really amazing formula. Um, you guys will see my application. Super easy to apply. And this one is opaque in two coats um, on my nails. And I have pretty long nails right now. So that's pretty good for um, opaqueness. Is that a word? <laughs> I don't know if it's a word anyway. Opaqueness. So we're going to say it's a word. Um, but yeah, so you might want to pick this one up. It is gorgeous. This is Forever Rose. Price of $13 with a cap of $160 from Trio Lacquer. Okay, next I have one from Moonshine Manny. Um, this is inspired by, oh wait, hold up, let me show you guys. <laughs> this is her polish, her contribution, look how pretty and shimmery. I love the shimmer in this one, it's really gorgeous. Um, so it's inspired by Everchill Argyle from the TV show Stranger Things. Um, it's a vibrant turquoise jelly with strong gold orange red glow and packed with hollow flakies totally just reminded me that i need to catch up on stranger things because i have i started watching the new season and then i stopped so i gotta catch up <laughs> thanks for that reminder phoebe um this is priced at 13 dollars with a cap of 200 it's really shimmery and that shimmer is gorgeous on the nails it absolutely pops this is opaque in two coats Really amazing formula. It is buttery, as I like to say. Um, and let's see, what else can I tell you about this polish? Um, you guys are going to see how um, easy it applies. Oh my gosh, I'm looking at my swatches and I'm getting, I'm like, this is so pretty. It is so pretty. Um, let's see. Yeah, that's, that's, that's all I can, <laughs> that's all I can tell you guys. It is gorgeous. So pretty. Amazing formula. Um, this color blue is really complimentary to the gold shimmer in here. Like, it is just like everything. So, definitely consider picking this up. That's Moonshine Manny. Um, ooh, did I even tell you guys the name? I don't even think I did. Oh, no, that's unacceptable. I gotta find. Hold on. <coughs> mm, excuse me. So the name is Try Before You Deny. I can't believe I was about to just like, oh, well, that's backwards for you guys. But anyway, Try Before You Deny. And I can't believe I was about to just let this go without giving you the name. Like, I don't even know who I am right now. Um, so price of $13, Kappa 200, Moonshine Manny. Um, next, I have one from Restored by Polish, y'all. Oh my gosh, this one is gorgeous, and it was designed by, by my good friend Krista, and I remember thinking when she designed this polish that they should totally sell it, because it's really pretty. <laughs> like I was like, this is gorgeous. So, um, let me give you guys the description. It's inspired by 
Krista, Jacqueline's sidekick. Um, which if you guys are not subscribed to Restore by Polish, you totally should. They have this like kind of, I don't know, friend thing going on. Um, and you know, there aren't really many of us YouTubers that do like a, a you know, sidekick kind of gig. So it's really fun. Their videos are very creative and they actually talk about a lot of different polish related things. So if you are not subscribed to them, definitely consider that. So this is Restored by Polish, and it is um, called Better Together. So it is a pink leaning coral packed with an array of color shifting iridescent flakies. It's opaque in two to three coats, depending on nail length. Let me give you guys a couple um, closer look. I don't know why I didn't do this earlier. I got this opaque in two coats, and my nails are pretty long, so that tells you a little bit about how opaque it is. It's a really good formula you guys are seeing my, um, in my live swatch. It's going to be $12.50 with a cap of $100, so you guys are going to want to pick this up. Like, it's, like, did y'all, did y'all, no, did y'all see the flakies? Like, are y'all checking this out? Because, what? <laughs> They're so pretty. Um, so there's a little, um, I don't know what you call this, little paragraph in here about, um, how this polish came to be. So you guys will want to read that. I'm not going to read it now because it's kind of long, but um, definitely consider picking this one up. Better Together by Restore by Polish. It'll be $12.50 with a cap of $100. Next, I have one from Lynn B Designs. This one is um, called Together or Not at All. Um, so let me show you guys the polish first. I keep forgetting to do that. I'm trying to make sure I give y'all the name and show you guys polish. Like there's a method to my madness. I have a whole thing that I do here. It makes my editing a lot easier too. So um, this is inspired by Amy and Roy from Doctor Who, who are two of my favorite sidekicks. Together or not at all is a pale seafoam green base filled to the brim with scattered hollow and hollow flakies with pink to orange to gold shifting shimmer and it's going to be priced at $13 with no cap. Here's a closer look at that. Y'all, this is so gorgeous on the nails. If you have not picked up a polish um, from Limby Designs with this formula, like she kills it. She does these formulas so good. I have been swatching for her for a while now and I don't even know how to describe. Like she just does a shimmer with the like holographic flakies and um, they're so shifty and just gorgeous. And this is really ethereal on the nails. Somebody's pizza is ready. Um, so again, if you guys want to pick this one up, this will be priced at $13. There's no cap. So you do not have to hurry. And that's, um, ooh, I'm forgetting the name. Together or Not at All by Lynn B Designs. Okay, so I also have one from Adored Colors. And... Let me show you guys so I can get my my uh, order of doing things together. Look at those flakies. So pretty. Um, so this one is inspired by Jeff Dunham, Dunham's Halloween edition comedy sketch where Jose Jalapeno on the stick plays Bun Nuts, a.k.a. Peanut Sidekick Ruben. I feel like I've seen this before. <laughs> um, now I'm going to have to go look it up. But Ruben is a black and olive green base filled with gold to green, chameleon glitter, and violet pink gold flakes. It's best in two to three coats. I got this opaque in two coats on my longer nails. Y'all, these flakies in this base, um, they, they pop and they're so gorgeous on the nails. You wouldn't think, because looking at this, it's a pretty dark base, right? I mean, it's olive and, and it's shimmery, but it's a pretty dark base. But these... I don't know how she does it. Like, I'm not sure exactly how she gets these flakies to be so apparent on the nails, but they are, they're gorgeous. My swatches actually are not going to do it justice. Um, so definitely go and check out some other pictures, um, swatch picks. Um, well, there's a couple where you can kind of see what I'm talking about, but, um, I just really love the flaky combination in here. And that's saying a lot for a non green polished wearing person, which is me. Um, but this looks really good with my skin tone as well. So as much as I don't like green, 
it does look good on my skin tone so i'm like okay i'm gonna wear the polish like i'm gonna wear it that's all there is to it so this will be priced at 11.50 with a cap of 100 so pretty low cap on this one so you might want to jump in there and snag it when you can um also a really good formula on this one as well so that one is that one from adored colors and lastly i have a um miscellaneous item so this is a um ring from rmp jewelry she will be um contributing this to polish pickup it is inspired by the perfect sidekick to the heart studs oh i should i have actually have the heart studs and they're really cute but if you imagine this heart as a stud earring <laughs> Or if you picked up the heart stud earrings, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And this is the perfect pair with that. So pretty. Um, so it's an open heart ring, which is the sidekick to our open heart earrings that they offered previously in um, PPU. It is an 18 gauge 0.925 sterling silver band. Um, it's super easy to wear. It's very comfortable. It's going to be priced at $15. Um, with a cap of 50 and this will be in a size six now since i swatched for her she does my rings for my ring size i have really tiny <laughs> fingers even my ring finger is like barely a five so um this is actually a size three but i'm going to show you guys how that fits so this is the way it fits on me they're really comfortable i really like wearing them when i swatch but i also just wear them when i'm not swatching because like they're really they're not like some other rings that i don't know like get kind of annoying for me if i'm wearing them further down on my finger um because of the shape of the heart and so it makes it really comfortable um i'm trying to slide it down so you guys can kind of see how it fits but yeah that's it and it is super pretty really comfortable um, it's not focusing. <laughs> uh, I don't know why it's not focusing. Oh, there it goes. Um, it focused for a second and then it unfocused. So if you're interested in that, it's from RMP Jewelry with, um, price of $15 with a cap of 50 and that will be a size six. Um, so there's that ring and I will insert my swatch pics of that one as well. I know you guys are going to ask me, so I'm going to go ahead and tell you, and I think it's probably okay to tell you because this polish is actually being advertised right now, but this is um, the polish on my nails. I was like, I know they're going to ask me. Um, blah, blah, blah from the Hotel Transylvania Movie Duo. Is that, am I reading that right? Yeah. Movie Duo from All Mixed Up Lacquers. Look how cute that is. I really like this. Um, <clears throat> so you guys will actually see this one also on my Instagram. I'll post swatch pics of it and talk more about the duo. So if you guys want to pick that up, if you're interested, it will be on my Instagram. That's it. <laughs> um, so I just have those seven polishes. That was seven, right? And a miscellaneous item to show you guys. Hopefully you guys will, um, be able to get your wish list together. It is... What time is it? 5.41 on Thursday evening. So Polish Pickup goes live tomorrow at 10 a.m. So hopefully you guys are getting your wish list together. I'm going to try to get this up tonight. Um, there'll be some editing to do. So I will try to do that for you guys so you guys can check out these um, polishes and see if you want to add them to your wish list. So if you're joining me for the first time and you enjoyed my video consider subscribing give it a thumbs up hit the notification bell so you can see when i post videos in the future and of course i would love to have you um, we talk about all polish related stuff and have a lot of fun on this channel so if you're interested in that consider subscribing um and that's it that's all i have so um i will see you guys in the next video i love you guys so so much bye Okay, so I know I said goodbye, but I had to um, call my child in here because I remembered that she wanted to end the video. Um, she stopped messing with the <laughs> tripod. 
So, um, now I have to do my ending all over again. Hopefully you guys are having an awesome day. Thank you for joining me, and I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, Posh Beeps. Bye.